watch this one be with you. Finally made a stone hedge. Uh, here's Mount Hood. It's kind of windy. Oily, windy. And here's Stone Hedge. I'm not sure what dam this is. It's a damn dam. <laughs> but it's on the Columbia River. So we were just driving along and I looked over and I was like, oh my goodness, this looks like an alien. The sanitarium. The sanitarium. Mm -hmm. Got all new windows. And there's a little steam coming from the lake. Which we can right see, there, see right here. Very hot water, see? This is on the side of the mountain. It's an HL guessing for hot lake mm -hmm. and if we zoom out there's the lake and the steam caution very hot water as you can see okay they took us up and showed us the room where they did the medical and they had a, what did they call it, the blood drain <laughs> in the floor. A big hole in the floor. A big hole in the floor. What did I run over? What did get for? Here's your friend. Ready? We're trying to send the cows home. <laughs> yeah. Except for lost cows. Yeah. Now, of course, he quit doing it, so. One more time, please. One more time, please. What? Oh, oh. what had the cow thing? That's why we were doing it. Uh, yeah, we do. It was funny. Yeah. They're all, they ran up over the hill now. It's hot. It's hot. Yeah, we've done the echoes down, huh? Mm -mm. 
And you've been here all day, huh? All day. And 10 o'clock this morning. We appreciate your dedication. Yeah. I'll be up with a check. Money only. <laughs> yeah. Okay, here they come. Nice meeting you. Yeah, I don't know who that is. Well, they flying. Oh, they let the traffic go. They're coming back this way now. Uh-huh. They're not coming on my uh, side, are they? Huh? Huh? Why are they going so fast? Two, we're leaving our hotel and headed to Bagel. For lunch. For lunch. For the Hampton Geyser Hotel. How the hotel? There you go. There nice place. Very nice. Oh, Here we go. Is there's mountains. Oh. 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 Look at these mountains. did that with Claudia and I filmed that it was real windy and they were just yeah. pedaling away, huh? Yeah. Look at the pretty trees. That's a little park. Look, look. See? Okay. Look at here. at the Great uh, Geyser Hotel in Baker, you found this beauty here. It's just beautiful. Again with the mountains in the background. This old majestic building. Which lies in the city of, uh, which lies in the middle of, uh, in the center of Baker City, Oregon. And, uh, We've been here before and had dinner, Claudia and myself. We're in Haynes, Oregon, and this is a little city park. And this is a little cabin. cabin. It was built in 1800s in Whitney as a barn or utility building. And it disassembled and then, oh, those are the actual buildings and they brought them all in here. These pe people must have been short, huh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Cool. So, we met an old timer. He tipped his hat to us, called us gals. See? But he's 82, so I guess he can't call us gals. No? Yeah. Yeah. When I read that, I said, uh, I thought it said, um, dedicated to the memory of Harry Potter. But then, but then I said, Pioneers. Pioneers, so yeah, from Harry Potter. This would be the second building at Mount Carmel, the Mount Carmel Mail Drop. And, uh, huh, it, uh, it was brought here in 1994. It's amazing how little those buildings are, huh? Yeah. Well, they were preserving trees back then, I think, huh? Well, no, not really. No, not really. Maybe they were just little people. That's the second building. Yeah. This That's is Go ahead. second building, Hawkins Cabin, built in the 1800s. Uh, I'll read it. Okay. Um, it, it was, uh, first it was a home and then it was a line shack for the cowboys. It came from five miles from here. I was brought in 1993. That's probably, I haven't seen it. It just all came in. And so they put it here, and uh, 
we'll, yeah, we'll, we'll give you a Here's the park. It's kind of small, but, you know, it does the point. And then if we move over, there's a little mining car with oh, yeah. tracks that go around. Yeah, and that, and that's a... Uh, well, it says samples, but we don't have one. And Ina said you got a leprechaun, huh? I got a leprechaun boot, and there's a little mining shack uh -huh. to accompany with our ma mining town house. I wonder what this is called right here. House. And there's little things on the roof. A stuff on the roof if you run out of storage place. Little bikes and cars. <laughs> Hi, guys. The wind's moving, so they're pedaling now. Yeah. Cool, huh? Uh, a lot of little parks and things. We are at the 45th parallel, halfway between the equator and the North Pole. Yeah. Cool. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. Well, we had an ice cream across from the Union Hotel. In Union, Oregon. And now we're going to uh, La Grande. Great ice cream. Going to La Grande to spend the night. This is a uh, this is a field where I spotted some discrepancy last night, and I don't know where it is now. But it's across from our regular. Um, crop circle field, and it's hard to see from this side. But it has to be this field. But there was so much traffic, we couldn't double back. But it had all the categoristics, there were no walking paths, nothing. travelers. So Ebony, yeah. what do you think so far? Let's yes. see, we've had Mount St. Helens. Erupting. Yes. We went to Mary Hill. Well, well think of the odds of that mountain erupting when we was going there. Uh, well, actually, we didn't really go there. We drove on the foothills, but one of the things we wanted to do we wanted to put an etheric or psychic spin on things instead yeah. of going on shop. One of the things we wanted to do is check on the mountain and see what it was doing. Mm -hmm. Because somebody had emailed me and said the mountain was going to explode sideways. And then, as a result of that, destroy the Bonneville Dam. Oh, yeah. Remember that? Uh-huh. On Father's Day, well, of course, I didn't know. But when it was all said and done, the night at the news, the way it erupted, everything did go sideways, didn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So did you get any impressions as we drove by there? No, I didn't. You didn't? Well, I know it wasn't going to... My impression was, no, it was not going to collapse the Van Dam mm -hmm. at this time. Okay. And then? Mary Hill Museum. Stonehenge first. No, museum. Oh, that's right. Yeah, but... Yes. Well, here, let me tell you the Mary, the, the, the Mary Hill uh, story. We were all clear to film and do the story. That actually was the deciding factor for us to go at this time. They said, come on and do the story. So we packed up the tripods and the whole thing. And on the way out, I checked the email. Uh huh. And a gentleman said, I got it here somewhere. Uh, can you reach behind you there? I'll read it to you. It said, Unfortunately, I had to be away from the museum for the past two days, and I'm just not getting to, to the emails. 
the museum's accreditation and insurance policy require that the museum staff person escort